Hello, good evening. Hello. Good evening. Hello. Hello. Good evening, Hello. teacher. Good, good evening, classmates. Good evening. How are you? Can't complain. Can't complain. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Perfect. Very but nice, I, teacher. Very good. That's what I like. And especially now that it's Friday. Finally, <laughs> Friday. Friday. Teacher, the phrase is saying thanks for good is Friday. Thanks, God. It's, it's uh, Friday. Well, well, Friday. It's yeah, a thanks. good movie. Thanks, God. Oh, that's a movie. Thanks, it's God. Was, it's Friday? Yeah. Yes. I've never watched yes, it. Yes, it's uh, a topic about dance, dance, to dance. And is it raining, guys, where you live? Raining. Yeah. Raining. Really no. In my place. Really not yet. But it's about to. It's about to rain. Here is about to rain. Here in, in my house, it, it seems like it's going to rain. Today here is only little tea. Drops. 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 Yeah, here too. I'm, in, I'm in, in my backyard and I see the linings. Oh, you see the linings. And you live, Briselda? Huh? Where do you live? I'm living in San Salvador. Oh, okay. And you see the linings here in Oriente? Yeah, you can you can hear the, the thunder and you can also hear, I mean, see the linings and you can hear like some drops. Maybe it's going to rain or not, but hopefully, because I cannot deal with the warm heat anymore. It's really, it's really like uh, humidity. Uh, There's a lot of humi humidity in the, in the air. That's what I don't like. Teacher, do you live do you live near of the coast? Like forty minutes away. The level the level for the live is almost seven hundred four hundred levels of above of the sea. I don't know that. Uh, but because because peak is almost four hundred. It's very, very hot here. But you live, but you live in San Salvador, Sirhan. No, no, I live in Casaltepeque. Oh, you live in Casaltepeque? Yes. Oh, so it's really hot as well. Wow, it's very, very hot. Sirhan, Sirhan, yes. eh, a popa is more uh, hot than Quesaltepeque. It's hotter. No, it's not more hot. I, 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 better. I, I, it's better. I don't believe I don't believe Quesaltepeque. Okay, is listen. Very warm so and hot. 400 meters above the sea. Yes. Usulutan really, is really... 90 meters. <laughs> 90. Not even 100. Wow. 90. <laughs> wow, 90. 90, yeah, 90 meters. Look, I look it up on the internet and this is what it shows. Look. 90 meters. Oh, it's yeah. very hot and warm. It's really hot and all, all, not only hot, it's humid. Like the environment is really humid. But I bet San Miguel, well, I don't know why, but I feel like San Miguel is worse. Like the but, temperature. But, but the weather in San Miguel is very hot, but, uh, but the weather is dry. It's hot, dry. Oh, you see, but San Miguel, it seems like San Miguel is higher. You see Usulután 90. Santa Ana 665, San Salvador 658. Well, I didn't know that. But anyways, I think like La Unión is the worst one. I don't know what, about, what you think. Yeah, La Unión, look, look at La Unión. Let's look at this, pay attention. 
No. Five. Five meters above the sea. Wow. Five. <laughs> that's what well, that's what I'm telling you. Usulutan is 90 and I feel like it's really hot. And you feel like I guess the peck is really hot even though it's 400. 400. But imagine here. My my brother uh, life lives for um, yes. um, months in La Union and he say he woke woke up at 3 a.m. and the water it was hot all the time. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I, I, and I Ready? bet because when you're walking there, I don't know, it's 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 awful. I don't. I, La Union is really awful. But saying the bridge, the La Union is very beautiful. Mm -hmm. La, La Union is very beautiful. The, the beaches, the beach. Okay. Okay, but where I live, so you see, Usulutan is 90 meters above the sea. Above the sea. But I don't live exactly in Usulutan. I live in Osatlan. So this is Osatlan. 218. Oh, okay. 18, yeah. It's not that much of a difference, but it's better. <laughs> <laughs> and the other thing that is good about the place where I live is that we have, we don't have streets like the cement streets. We don't have that. And we also don't have, um, like, and we have, I mean, we have a lot of trees around the house, a lot of trees. So it's not as hot as Usulutan, but mm, so so. The other one that is um, really hot is the place where I work because I work in, I don't know if you have ever heard about Hikilisco. Hikilisco, yeah. Puerto Parada. Exactly. So this is Hikilisco, look. <laughs> 44 meters. Yeah. And I was working there today and I had to do the, like the package they give to the poor families, like the students' families, they give some packages. And, but we, the teachers have to work like putting all the things together and all the stuff. And I was working really hard today. And my, my shirt was all wet, like all wet. Right. My face mask, was like, I could do this, like it was really wet and I had to change my face mask three times because it was wow. horrible. It was horrible, yeah. But I hope it breaks. Anyways, let's go back to the topic <laughs> because we are, uh, we're here. Look, I cannot, I don't know why, but for some reason, a strange reason, uh, the video that I showed you yesterday, the intro video for section three, yes. YouTube says that is, YouTube says that is, um, it has copyrights. I don't know why, but it says that it has copyrights. So I'm gonna send you the video and you have to watch it on the breakout rooms because you know the stone. copyright. The um, stone page. What is it? The stone page. The what? video, the video, the video yesterday, the, the stone page. For yeah, the yeah, yeah, exactly, 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 exactly. So it's, it has copyright on YouTube. So I cannot play the video. Are you from a computer, Sirhan? Yes. Can you share the sound? Yes. Like, okay. sound and video. No, sound and video. So okay. I'm gonna, I sent you the video there and I'm gonna open a breaker room. You play the video twice for your classmates, and then we're gonna talk a little bit about it here in the main session. But I cannot play it because if I play it, YouTube, it's gonna uh, put like a restrict restriction over this video, okay? Do you do you get the idea? Yeah? yeah. Okay. Play, play right now or? No, 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 in the breaker room. I'm gonna send you guys yes, to the breaker room. Okay. There you go. Okay.
Marielo, welcome to the class. I thought you were you weren't coming. Uh, excuse me, teacher. Just uh, come back home. What is it? I'm just coming uh, at home. Oh, okay. I'm gonna send you to the break rooms because your classmates are playing a video, a video that I yes. cannot play here because of the co copyright. Okay. 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 Perfect. So what do you think happened at Stonehenge? So actually, there are a lot of people, like a lot of people, who think that, um, for example, the pyramids that the Egypts had, the Egyptians had, right? The pyramids, um, also the Stonehenge, for example, or the archeological sites that we have here in El Salvador as well. Some people think that, well, I don't know. I don't know what you think, but some people think that there was a alien intervention. Like there were- Al Alien intervention? Yeah. Aliens, uh, aliens, like the aliens came to the earth and they held those humans in the past to build those things first because they were really heavy stones to move 
Yes. And how could they have moved those really heavy stones if they didn't have the technology and the advance that we have nowadays? So what do you think? I think the alien intervention is a, is a, a lot of theory. Mm -hmm. uh, I think too, that stone stonefish is uh, created uh, for the, the humans, advancing human for this age. Okay. Uh, okay. Because, because uh, each stone is very, is very heavy, almost, 40, 50. Uh, and I don't know if you could hear it in the in the in the video. They are saying, well, they were saying there that those stones weren't from that place. They had to carry those stones from another place. And then besides carrying those stones, they have to put the stones up. And then put the other stunts off the other ones. Yeah. So do you yeah. think, well, this is a crazy idea. This is just speaking English. But you think do you think that can there can be alien aliens, aliens, alien intervention, intervention? Do you think that's possible? I think it's possible. Okay. Uh, I, I, I think it's possible too. That people know aliens. Uh, people are humans traveling to the past for help <laughs> for help, help okay. uh, a human. Maybe it's, it's another theory. Theory, yeah, I know. Okay. <laughs> what do the other classmates think? Nobody wants to participate. Oh, teacher, I think that is it. That's that. And another civilization, maybe, uh, put the, the stones there. <laughs> and uh, the video mentioned that it was a temple of the dead, maybe. And, and the stones uh, up the other <laughs> uh, seems um, when the people put a uh, person for a sacrifice, maybe. <laughs> Yeah, they can also be another thing. I think so. <laughs> but what do you think about the alien theory? It's, it's probably too. Maybe. Possible? Yeah. Okay, it's possible. Okay, okay. I like it. One day I was talking to my students, like to my little students, and I said something about this, right? And they were like, so, but teacher, why do you think there are aliens we don't we don't believe in that and i was like it's kind of crazy to think that we are one planet in a galaxy and there are millions of galaxies why will be will we be the only planet with humans or, or with I don't know, things that think, okay? And sometimes when people say that aliens are like green and big and stuff, and I'm like, maybe they are not, maybe they are like us, like, like, like us and living in another planet that seems like earth and has oxygen, water, trees, right? I don't know, it's kind of crazy. What do the other classmates think? And I thought what you said, Marielos, about the <laughs> sacrifices. Yeah, I thought also like maybe it was not a temple of the dead, maybe it was a place to do sacrifices. I don't know, maybe. I believe your theory teacher, because the astrologers have this uh, two Earth like planets in the in the Orion belt. In other galaxies, right? Orion belt in the same Orion belt. Uh -huh, Orion belt. Two okay. two worlds 
same like a uh, 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 earth. Earth, exactly. The only problem is that we cannot go there, right? Nobody. Because it's impossible. It was impossible to go to the moon, uh, but only, now uh, it's possible to do. Only with capsules, the Thundercat capsule. <laughs> Thundercat. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe. Who knows? Okay, so nobody wants to participate on this topic or give an opinion about it. One, two, three. No? Teacher. Miguel Angel. Teacher. Okay. I think uh, Teacher. it is a business for uh, hard money because it's a commercialization con with, with uh, tema, uh, what you say, uh, argument is, is uh, for commercialization is because uh, I don't, I don't contudent uh, theory for only it's, it's speculation because I don't have, uh, how do you say prayers? Proofs. Proofs. I don't have proofs. Uh, I think it's, it's, it's for business, for money, that's, uh, it's a movie, it's a... Okay, a, so you don't think there's life in other planets? It's difficult, it's a condition for planet is very difficult replicate replicate okay 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 well that's your opinion Miguel and, and maybe can be well like the the morbid uh, heads right they will think that yeah aliens and all this stuff and to make movies yes uh, that's that point is valid right like people like to take advantage of that but the movie Interstellar, Interstellar is wow, the, that's is, really good movie. Yeah, good movie. Interstellar. That's one of the best movies that I have ever watched. And Miguel. it's about the traveling to the space and also traveling in the time and then the dimensions. And, that's and, so and, crazy. And, and the black hole. Yeah, that's it's, that's it's so very, very interesting. Yeah, it's interesting. That's true. That's true. Well, I, I'm sorry, Milton. You were going to say something. Yes, teacher. For, for me, I, I seen a three. Uh, the first, it is possible, uh, was aliens, the past travel, uh, and then they help uh, the humanity. 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 Uh, the, the human in, in this moment for the construction is a member is a Okay, uh, um, Milton, I don't know why, but I, I, I could understand then, some things you were saying, like I can understand some things, but I think your internet connection, it's bad right now because you, uh, like your sound sounds really like with a lot of interference. So maybe I think your internet connection is bad right now. But I could catch some things you were saying, like, yeah, like there is intervention because life in the past was different and there could have been intervention. Yeah, and I understand that. Okay, good. And Milton, still, <laughs> Milton, we cannot hear you. Like the, your internet connection is really bad, really, really bad. <laughs> Okay, it's okay. possible is a uh, life in another in another galaxy he, he probably they they help the uh, the woman uh, the human okay okay yes well I could hear you better than that. yeah it, it's 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 really possible well but Miguel's points it's also valid because it's possible also that 
we we don't know. We're just making here speculations, and that's a topic. Yeah, you know, in advanced, the pre-advanced levels, we, what we want you to do is to speak. That's why they bring up these topics. So you can speak a little bit more because you're gonna be like, yeah, I want to speak about this because it's interesting and I have my point of view about it. Okay. All right, let's continue. We're gonna watch a video about the past, but not the past, like the Stonehenge. <laughs> it's about the past uh, of a person, of something that happened. Okay, so pay attention here. We're gonna do a couple of activities with this video. Hi, we're ready to play the next conversation, but we want you to be ready to answer these questions. Okay, first, pay attention to the conversation because later we're going to answer some questions with this conversation. I'm going to play it twice. You asked Beth to be here around 7 o'clock, didn't you? Yes. What time is it now? It's almost 8. I wonder what happened. Hmm. She might have forgotten the time. Why don't I call and see if she's on her way? I got her voicemail, so she must not have turned on her cell phone. I hope she didn't have a problem on the road. Her car could have broken down or something. Of course, she may have simply forgotten and done something else today. No, she couldn't have forgotten. I just talked to her about it yesterday. I guess we should start without her. What time? Hi, we're ready to play the next conversation, but we want you to be ready to answer these questions. You asked Beth to be here around 7 o'clock, didn't you? Yes. What time is it now? It's almost 8. I wonder what happened. Hmm. She might have forgotten the time. Why don't I call and see if she's on her way? I got her voicemail, so she must not have turned on her cell phone. I hope she didn't have a problem on the road. Her car could have broken down or something. Of course, she may have simply forgotten and done something else today. No, she couldn't have forgotten. I just talked to her about it yesterday. I guess we should start without her. Okay, now I want you to, okay, these questions we have here. The first question, can you read it, Maria Luz, please? Turn on your mic. Excuse me. Okay, what time was Beth asked to come? Okay, I don't know. okay, okay, it's okay. Um... Griselda, can you help me read the next question? The second one? Yeah. What time is it now? Thank you. Boris, would you mind reading the number three, please? But that's what I decided to do. I could hear you at the background, but yes. <laughs> Thank you. Sirhan, number four, please. No. Could you read number four, Sirhan, please? Okay. What time was that asking to come? No, number four. Okay, sorry. What can, why can we contact Beth? Thank you. And Miguel, number five and the last one. What do they decide to do? Decide. Decide. What decide. Do they decide to do? Okay. Okay, thank you. Well, now take a screenshot if you want of these questions. I'm going to play the conversation one more time and then you will have the opportunity to answer these questions. Take a screenshot? Yes. You took a screenshot already? Okay. Yes. Perfect. Now we're going to listen to the conversation one more time and you're, you have to answer these questions. Maybe I'm going to ask different people to give me the answer. These questions. 
You asked Beth to be here around 7 o'clock, didn't you? Yes. What time is it now? It's almost 8. I wonder what happened. Hmm. She might have forgotten the time. Why don't I call and see if she's on her way? I got her voicemail, so she must not have turned on her cell phone. I hope she didn't have a problem on the road. Her car could have broken down or something. Of course, she may have simply forgotten and done something else today. No, she couldn't have forgotten. I just talked to her about it yesterday. I guess we should start without her. What time was Beth asked to come? What time is it now? After these questions. You asked Beth to be here around 7 o'clock, didn't you? Yes. What time is it now? It's almost 8. I wonder what happened. Hmm. She might have forgotten the time. Why don't I call and see if she's on her way? I got her voicemail, so she must not have turned on her cell phone. I hope she didn't have a problem on the road. Her car could have broken down or something. Of course, she may have simply forgotten and done something else today. No, she couldn't have forgotten. I just talked to her about it yesterday. I guess we should start without her. What time was Beth asked to come? Okay, let's go with the first question. Milton, what time was Beth asked to come? Turn on your mic, please. Hello. What, yeah, what time was Beth asked to come? 7 p.m. 7 p.m.? Okay, well, they say seven, okay. Uh, number two, Griselda, what time is it now? Almost 80. Almost 80 or almost eight? Almost eight, sorry. Okay, okay, it's okay. Marielos, what does Will decide to do? Uh, Will decide to write a, a mail, or oh, I don't know, mail? To, who, who thinks different? Who has a different answer? Okay, the difference? No, no, no. If someone else has a different answer for that question, like what will decide to do? I remember that will decide to to call or exactly, decide. exactly, exactly to call her, to call her. Okay, and then there's the other question with that voicemail. Voicemail said uh -huh. <laughs> mail. Exactly, voicemail. Okay. Uh, Boris, why can't we contact Beth? Uh, because she's probably, uh, her cell phone is turned off. Okay. okay, thank you, Boris. Because her cell phone is turned off. Maybe he got the voicemail, right? Yes. He couldn't go, yeah, okay, thank you. Miguel. What do they decide to do? Because they can contact her and it's late. What do they decide to do, Miguel? They decide after. Uh, uh, sorry. I no? Don't worry. No. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. Okay, Sirhan, do you have the answer? What do they decide to do? They decide to start the the meeting or the, the party, party, the party, the party or the party. something they have, right? Okay, thank you, exactly. thank you, thank you, exactly, exactly. Okay, now let's listen to the rest of the conversation because here we're gonna listen what what happened to Beth. Okay, listen and pay attention because this part of the conversation is not written, so it's a listening activity. What do they decide to do? After answering all of those questions, now listen to the rest of the conversation and find out what happened to Beth. Listen to the rest of the conversation. 
What happened? Oh, here comes Beth now. Hey, guys. Sorry I'm late. I had an emergency. Oh, nothing serious, I hope. Well, kind of. It was Sally. Sally? Your dog? What happened? Well, I was just about to leave when she started acting strange. Then she just passed out. Oh, my gosh. I panicked. I thought she had died at first. I had to rush her to the emergency clinic. But is she okay? Oh, I hope she's all right. Yeah, she's going to be fine. The vet said it was some kind of virus. So he gave her an injection, and I had to leave her with him. I'll go by later and pick her up. Oh, but guess what? What? She's going to have puppies. Congratulations. You're going to be a grandmother. <laughs> very funny, Bill. Yeah, Bill. Very funny. I'm going to play one more time. Just one more time. Well, I was just... It was Sally. ...to the rest of the conversation. What happened? Oh, here comes Beth now. Hey, guys. Sorry I'm late. I had an emergency. Oh, nothing serious, I hope. Well, kind of. It was Sally. Sally? Your dog? What happened? Well, I was just about to leave when she started acting strange. Then she just passed out. Oh, my gosh. I panicked. I thought she had died at first. I had to rush her to the emergency clinic. But is she okay? Oh, I hope she's all right. Yeah, she's going to be fine. The vet said it was some kind of virus. So he gave her an injection, and I had to leave her with him. I'll go by later and pick her up. Oh, but guess what? What? She's going to have puppies. Congratulations. You're going to be a grandmother. <laughs> very funny, Bill. Yeah, Bill. Very funny. Mm, don't understand your question, Stefan. Maybe oh. you can re re read it, sure. rewrite it, because I can understand the, the, the question. Okay, now, why was Sally, I mean, why was Beth, <laughs> Beth late to the, to the party? She had a, an emergency with her dog. With yes. her dog, yeah. Sally, right? What was the emergency? What? What was the emergency? The emergency. Oh, the the dog was a um, stranger. Was that? Yeah, stranger. Um, because she uh, Dolly has puppies. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. so the dog passed out. Do you know the meaning of passed out? Passed out. Mm -hmm. Do you know what is the meaning of that? No. No. Passed out means desmayarse. Okay. Thanks. So the dog, Sally, passed out. And she had to take it where? Where did, where did that day? Took, I mean, where did Beth take Sally? Yeah, Sally, I think it was Sally. Yeah. Where? Beth take... To, to the emergency, to right? Emergency. To, the, to the clinic. Emergency, okay. And what happened to Sally? Why, why was she sick? Why was Sally sick? She's pregnant, right? She's yes. Pregnant. Okay. And now, getting back to your old well, and she's gonna have puppies, and the other person is gonna be a grandma. Okay. Dirhan, answer answering your question. Yes, I'm uh, guessing what you say because it is for animals, right? Yes. Uh -huh. But <laughs> people consider animals like people. And when you have a dog that is a female, you can refer to her as a she. 
And when you have a dog that is a male, you can refer to him as a he. In Salvador saying perrigos. Yeah, 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 exactly. Well, in El Salvador, we say that. For example, me, I don't have kids. Like I'm married, but I don't have kids. And I, but I have two dogs. I adopted two dogs. So yeah, uh, teacher, those things. But, but, but it's correct. To use she? Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. I, I bet. Because you can refer to dog, female dogs as she, uh -huh. and you can refer to male dog as he. Mm -hmm. It's it's okay and it's correct to say that. Uh, okay, this is my question. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. 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 Okay. If you don't know the gender of the animal, then you can say it. But if you know the gender, you can say she and he. Okay. Okay. Very good. Now we're gonna practice the conversation. I'm gonna read the conversation one more time, and then you will have time to practice. You asked. I don't want you say ask it. It's not ask it. No, 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 no. Ask it is for basic students. Basic. They are saying ask it, but you are pre advanced. So it's asked. Asked. You asked Beth to be here around seven. Didn't you? Yes. What time is it now? It's almost eight. I wonder what happened. Mm, she might have forgotten the time. Why don't I call and see if she's on her way? A few minutes later. I got her voicemail. So she must not have turned on her cell phone. I hope she didn't have a problem on the road. Her car could have broken or something. Of course, she might have simply forgotten and done something else. No, she couldn't have forgotten. I just talked, talked. So say talked, no, talked. I just talked to her about it yesterday, I guess. We should start without her, without her. Okay, now, gonna back, go back. You asked Beth to be here around seven, didn't you? Okay, so, but now, now, like, this is also something that I tell my basic one, basic two, basic three students. When you're saying a conversation, try to put your feelings into it, to give the intonation. Because if you're saying like, uh, you asked Beth to be here around seven, didn't you? Yes, what time is it now? It's almost eight, I wonder what happened. That's not correct because that's like reading, not doing a role play conversation, okay? So you have to do the intonation. And here guys, it's happened, happened with the D sound at the end, happened, happened. Don't say happened, please. You're gonna break my heart if you say happened or or ask it, or the other one that is around here. Okay. <clears throat> you asked Beth to be here around seven, didn't you? Yes. What time is it now? It's almost eight. I wonder what happened. Hmm. She might have forgotten the time. Why don't I call her? I mean, why don't I call and see if she's on her way? I got her voicemail. So she must not have turned on her cell phone. I hope she didn't have a problem on the road. Her car could have broken down or something. Of course, she might have simply forgotten and done something else today. No, she couldn't have forgotten. I just talked to her about it yesterday. I guess we should start without her. Yep, okay. Do you need me to repeat something or is it okay? Good to go. It's okay. Okay, perfect. Piece of cake. It's a piece of it's cake. Okay. Uh huh. Okay, let me see. These guys don't go because when you leave the break of rooms, then your classmates are alone. And that's not correct. I don't like that. Okay, now let's go and practice.
we sell that. Okay. Okay, repeat. Uh, I started again. Okay. You asked Beth to be here, here around seven, didn't you? Yes. What time is it now? It's almost eight. I wonder how, what happened. Hmm. She might have forgotten the time. Why don't I call? I call and see if she's on her way. I got her voicemail. So she must not have turned on her cell phone. I hope she didn't have a problem on the road. Her, call, her car could have broken down or something. Of course, she might have simply forgotten and done something else today. No, she couldn't have forgotten. 
I just talking to her about it yesterday. I It's almost time. Well, it's time already. So. <laughs> I just want to mention something, guys. I went to the break rooms and I heard that you're still saying ask it or talking. You say talking instead of talk it, talk it, talk it, talking. It's talked. Talk. Happened. Talk. It's happened, happened with the at the end. The this one at the end. Happened. Happened. Asked. Happened. Asked. Happened. It's not ask it. It's not ask it. Asked. 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 Okay. Pay attention Asked. to those specific pronunciations because they Asked. are the simple past. Simple past of the yes. regular verbs. Remember, if it doesn't make a vibration, it's t asked. Asked. But if asked. it makes a vibration, it's th Listened, Asked. happened, Asked. traveled, happened, okay. traveled. Perfect, guys. Traveled. So, okay. traveled. Happy vacation. I will see you guys and teacher. tomorrow. What tomorrow? What? I will see you guys in one week. One week. One week. More than one week, actually. More than one week. Yeah. I will see you guys on Monday. 18. Let me see. Monday, Monday 18th. Thursday. 18th. 18th. Monday, 18th. Tuesday. Tuesday. I don't know. No. It's Monday. Yeah, it's Monday. On next week, we don't have I class. I the party. What is it, Griselda? The next week, we don't have class. No, we don't. No. Okay. Vacation. <laughs> yes. vacation. Thank you, teacher. Bye. Thank have a good vacation. Bye. Be safe. Be safe. Bye. Be safe, OK? Bye. 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 Bye.